We often get referrals in ophthalmology from optometrists, GPs, or from friends saying that uh, they're sending a patient with a double vision. Well, double vision is quite a broad definition. We would actually like to know is this double vision, proper double vision, where you see two clear objects? Is it double vision with one eye? Or is it just blurred vision? And what we would like to do is the following. Differentiate these three. How do we do it? Okay. It's extremely important that patients visual acuity gets tested with their best correction. Is that contact lens that they're wearing? Is that gla TV, driving glasses, not, not reading, driving glasses that they're wearing? So we are going to put the best optical correction in front of them and ask them to look at the visual acuity chart. At that stage, we would ask the patient to cover one eye, please cover the left eye, and look at the chart. Mm. Now, patient may say with the best correction that they see that largest letter or any target that we shown as a double image. Usually they would say it's a ghosted image. That means one is reasonably clear and the other one in the background is like a shadow of a letter. That is monocular diplopia. That means in one eye we see two images. Okay. And that is often if we are not optically well corrected or if we have some media problems like a corneal problem or so cataract forming or some vitreous problems that will potentially split our image. There are generally saying three major areas where you need to think of when somebody comes with a monocular diplopia. That's a cornea, usually some obstruction in the cornea that's a lens changes, cataract, most common, or retina, macula. So those are the three things that you think of if somebody best corrected, covered one eye, looks at the target and sees two targets, monocular diplopia, three most common causes. Think cornea, lens, retina. Okay. Then we would do the same thing, cover the right eye, and we do the same thing with the other eye. And patients is single or double. If they are seeing single with one eye and double with the other, usually what happens? You would see two with one and one with the other. You should have triplopia, so you should have triple image, not double. If you see with one eye clear, let's say cover your left eye again, that should be clear. Mm -hmm. Now cover your right eye again. That is clear. Open both, that's double. So each eye sees single image. Both eyes open, double image. That's a classic example of binocular diplopia. So you can have a perfectly clear image on one, perfectly clear image on the other, and see as two images. Okay? And that's very important to differentiate when somebody complains of double. And from practical clinical experience, most of the double vision complaints are uniocular diplopia through media opacity or binocular through media opacity. So you have a cataract in one, cataract in the other one. You see ghosted and clear image and you see that's double, which it is. But in neuroophthalmological terms, double vision is binocular double vision is single clear, single clear, both open, double vision.